So tonight, for the first time in weeks, I have something to procrastinate, and you know how we do, we procrastinate cook. Let's make Masi. So a little, a little insight on what Masi is, Masi can be found in any type of Southeast Asian, Asian country, it just has a different name for it. You can stuff dango balls, you have peanut rolls in Taiwan, and over here in the Philippines we call it Masi. I'm not entirely sure if that's coming from a Chinese influence or whatever, but we're gonna make it. Alright, let's start. We're gonna start off by making our filling. So we're gonna chop some peanuts, make sure it's all ground and fine and whatever. Because you don't want those chunky bits, unless you do, you know, it's a preferential thing. But I like them like really minced up and whatnot. You can do this with an electric grinder, I guess. Too lazy to just whip it out, you know. So chop it real fine, like so. Once everything is relatively even in size, relatively, I'm not perfect, put that all in a bowl. Mix in some brown sugar. Now it's time to repair our dough. Alright, glutinous rice flour. Just put some on there. Look, it's 2 a.m. I'm not gonna measure anything because that's just too much effort, not too much effort. Alright, start mixing it. Make sure it forms a cohesive bolus. No, not bolus. Dough. So I'm mixing it until it makes into a dough. Make sure you don't put as much water. Make sure you don't put too much water because that, that's not going to work. This is almost done, but it needs a little bit more water. Make sure, make sure that when you pull it apart, it doesn't separate like this. So, a little bit more. A little bit more. Oh, too much. <laughs> Too much, too much, abort, abort, too much. But no worries, if we added a little too much water, then let's just add a little bit more flour. You know, it's not that hard. Okay, once it forms this little Play-Doh consistency, we're ready to roll it. Okay, once we're done, we take a little bit, roll it up, punch a hole in the middle, make sure to not overstuff, just a little bit. Go. 
Okay, so don't be worried when you do a little something like this. Let's just do a little bit of Masi first aid. <laughs> okay. <laughs> so, crimp that together. And then make sure you cover it up with a big piece of that. Right? And then just cover up the hole like nothing happened. No one's gonna know. Next is we drop it over a pot of boiling water. Make sure to spoon it in individually so that you prevent them from sticking and no splashes because we don't want that. Okay, so these are about done. Just have to take them out and then let them cool out, chill out for a bit so that you don't burn yourself <laughs> eating them. So these get fairly sticky. See? So we're gonna remediate that by putting some cornstarch. Just a little bit. Just coat it in your cornstarch so it doesn't like stick. And there you go. Awesome.